So there I was, face to face with the biggest, meanest leopard on this side of the Serengeti, and... You roared so loud, his spots flew clean off. Dad, I've heard this like a billion times. Uh, do you know the one where I made the laughing hyenas cry? cry? Yep. The croc attack? Dad. Okay, think. <laughs> yeah, you do that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Mr. Smart Guy. Here's one I know you haven't heard. It all started in a little place I like to call the wild. They were the fastest wildebeest on the savanna. We're talking fast. All the other lions had given up the hunt hours ago, except your old man. Fortunately, I knew a shortcut. <laughs> Until the dust cleared. Classic wildebeest trap. So what did you do next? What did I do? Yeah. That's when I gave them the roar. That's it? Hold on a sec. I only thought it was over, but they had a secret weapon. He was the biggest wildebeest I'd ever seen. He was 14 feet tall. 14? I meant 14 hundred and one feet tall. Cool. And he had two, no, four of the biggest horns I'd ever seen. Huh? Whoa. His breath was red hot. I mean green. And he hated the environment. <gasps> to pull this off, I knew I was gonna have to dig deep. Deeper than I ever had before. So I swallowed my fear. Sucked in the biggest breath I could. Dad, I'm ready. You got it? I got it! I got it! Well, let him have it! Roar, son! <laughs> Your roar stops to hurt a wildebeest. Mine makes the babies laugh. Hey, come on! That was much better. I'm serious. It dropped half an octave. Dropped half an octave? <laughs> and it sure scared me. Made my hair stand up on end. You're right, Dad. <laughs> okay, let's take it from the top. I'm done for.